Let us know if you guys need anything. We'd be happy to help. Look, man, I... I know you think your girlfriend cheated on you with me, but... For the life of me, I, I can't figure out why. Now, I want you to understand. I've never been involved with anything that could be considered cheating whatsoever. You could talk to your boys Chase and Ryan. They were at my house party 15 times in the past six months. I, I got nothing to hide. Uh, well, Chase and Ryan aren't really my boys. I was told about this from my other homie, Nick. Exactly. Nick, an actual f boy. So it makes me wonder what the hell you're coming at me for. I mean, I have a girlfriend right now. I'm in a happy relationship myself. Honestly, what is it that you think I did or do? I, I don't get it. Well, listen, I was just told that my girlfriend cheated on me with you at one of your house parties. No, I get that. I understand. With that being said, the guy who told me is a bit of a blackout. You know, tries to be the center of attention at parties. He still blows in his beer pong cups instead of fingering. Very high school. But obviously, I'm in a serious, committed relationship. So I end up having to be the schmuck who does all the ass. Yeah, you're just covering your bases. I get it. You understand. You sure you don't want anything? A beer? White Claw? Nothing? Uh, no, I gotta drive home. Let me ask you something. And if you don't want to get too personal, just tell me to shut up at any time. Oh. How many times do you think your girlfriend cheated on you? Well, no, but it pisses me off. You think about the nice guys that should be pulling a ton of women, like you, chefs, male nurses, veterinarians. End of the day, you guys get skinned alive romantically by these thoughts. You no, know, for example, one of my boys, very nice guy, pastry chef, walks in, his girlfriend's cheating on him with the pool boy. Jesus. Leads to a horrible breakup, right? The fighting, get out of my house, the king of the cars. They had a dog. Oh, horrible situation. Sure. So his confidence is shattered. He's feeling down. But me and some of my boys take him out for a night at the strip club. On the right night, at the right time, we gave him the proper guidance and boom. Overnight, his entire confidence with women changed. So what ended up happening with your buddy after the strip club? He just go on a tear after that? Well, that particular night out, one night out, he ended up going home with two beautiful dancers and hasn't had a dry weekend since. And I'd go out and chase tail with anyone. Anyone who needs proper guidance. Can you say that again? Just the way you said it. Just the same way. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, come on. I think you do know what I'm talking about. If I'm not mistaken, you just admitted that you would be willing to cheat on not your girlfriend. technically. I didn't mention anyone cheating. Which leads cheating. me to believe that you would have no problem hooking up with my girlfriend, you sick oh, douchebag. According to the U.S. Pro Code, there needs to be an exact time and place with the woman involved. You can call my girlfriend right now. That wouldn't hold up. <laughs> That's not how I uh, heard it. Well, sometimes when you sail a boat fit for a f boy, you gotta play the part. I think it's time you both get the f*** off my boat. You know, this really is such a nice boat. You probably pull so many chicks in this. Good for you, little dick. Little dick? Mean a little dick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, f it, he f f Look at his face, you cheating piece of garbage. <laughs> it's beautiful. Uh, get the f*** off my boat. Get the f*** out of my girl's DMs. Hey, have fun on your Uber ride home to your miserable cheating girlfriend, prick. Hey, take some white cloths for the road. I know you only drink Trulies. Fucking cheap fucks. Hey, look what I found in my pocket. I call them fun balloons. Mr. 